Thank you, Horace. And then icing over a uh, concern, uh, obviously affecting decisions being made across the area. We're getting word right now that Shenandoah County Schools have decided that they will be closed for tomorrow. So all of those in the area, Shenandoah County Schools will be closed for tomorrow. Now, another area that's been hard hit is uh, Winchester near the Virginia, West Virginia line. Our Jake Corbett spent the past 24 hours out in Winchester. He's joining us now live with a look at the mess and how people are coping with it out there. Jay? Well, this rare March storm really hit Winchester hard, especially in the first half of the day. The state, city of Winchester, and its residents, armed with a battalion of strong backs and a fleet of heavy equipment, took on a winter storm that dropped nearly eight inches of snow by 8 a.m. It's wet, it's heavy. Hurt your back. While Doug Jones and his crew shoveled a sidewalk, all around them, graders, backhoes, big plows, and little ones were clearing parking lots and primary roads. Anything's got a blade, it's going to push it. Despite the accumulation, crews did not have a hard time pushing around this mess because it was so wet. In fact, most roadways were passable, even side streets. Drivers heeded warnings and stayed home, like Tom Ford. I feel sorry for the people that has to go up and down the roads, but fortunately, I can I can be home. This admitted fan of winter. I like snow. I just love snow. Employed a snowblower to beat back a surprising March storm. Oh, it's terrible. Storm's terrible. If, they, if you can stay home, stay out of it. It's wet, heavy, nasty to drive. Now, we should emphasize that uh, Virginia Department of Transportation officials are not resting on their laurels despite the fact that the roads look great out here. They say many, many crews will remain working into the night to make sure conditions are safe for travelers. Live in Winchester, Jay Korf, ABC 7 News.